YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Booba, and welcome back to another player review on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. In today's video, we're going to go ahead and check out our very first Future Stars midfielder evolution. It's none other than Udley. Udley is an 89 rated card. He has high medium work rates, right footed with three star skill moves and four star weak foot. Now, we don't see much versatility with the card as he can only play the center attacking mid and center mid positions. If we go ahead and look at his in game stats in a bit more detail, we can see that the card is extremely well rounded. He is Hula Gang. He does have 89 pace with 90 acceleration and 89 sprint speed for a center mid that's actually really solid now because he does have high medium work rates we do need him to be a bit of a threat going forward as well 85 shooting with 88 attacking positioning 78 finishing is not half bad now the 96 shot power and 92 long shots is going to be something very interesting to test out in game i think his long shots are going to be cracked 89 passing another very solid stat for a center mid he does have 91 vision 90 short pass and 89 long pass his passing in game should be very accurate now although the card does have 89 dribbling overall he does only have 80 adjacent agility and 83 balance so he might be a tad bit clunky on the ball but he has great reactions at 93 90 ball control and 93 composure some really solid stats right there now because he is a center mid we do need a bit of defensive cover as well 81 defending is an okay stat 83 interceptions with 80 defensive awareness and 83 stand tackle and then last but not least boys 82 physical for the card as well 85 stamina pretty decent right there 81 strength and 79 aggression i think his physicality is going to be very important in game if we jump on over to footbin boys we can see that Adli does have four different play styles he has the tiki taka and intercept play style plus and then he does also have the technical and first touch so some pretty decent play styles right there now when it comes to chemistry styles it's going to come down to how you do want to go ahead and incorporate him in game if you do want him to be in a bit more of an advanced position then i do think that the hunter is going to be a really good option with the hunter he is going to have 97 pace overall with 98 acceleration and 97 sprint speed should be very quick in game and it's also going to give him 90 shooting overall now keep in mind he doesn't have the craziest of finishing but with the hunter we do upgrade that to 86 which is pretty decent and then also 99 shot power now if you do want the card to maybe be a bit more balanced then i do think that the shadow is another very good option we do need that pace upgrade so 97 pace again and then it's also going to give him 87 defending 91 interceptions 84 defensive awareness and 91 stand tackle that's a pretty decent upgrade right there now boys really quickly because we are going to go ahead and test him out with the hunter chem style in today's video if we go ahead and look at this little chart right here he does become a 91 rated center forward so that's going to be very interesting to test out in game as as always boys if you guys do enjoy these fc24 player reviews go ahead and do me a huge favor if you guys can leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is a team we're going to be using in foot champions to test out the new oddly card we're going to be playing him at the center mid position in the 4-3-2-1 formation so without further ado boys let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is all right boys here we are jumping into game number one using oddly i must say man i'm actually really excited to test this card out we're coming up against a pretty solid team shevchenko hansen martinelli pina but yeah boys the plan is to go ahead and use him as a more advanced center mid in the 4-3-2-1 if we go ahead and test out the car's dribbling real quick he doesn't have the craziest of agility and balance but the rest of his dribbling stats are really good and for the most part the left stick dribbling isn't half bad i do think that you can get the job done with him now as a center mid we do need him to be a little bit balanced so we're going to test him out going forward and then also defensively he does have the intercept play style plus which is really nice a little bit of r1 dribbling right there good strength boys that's going to be a huge part to his game. He, it looks like he does have a bigger build as well. Nice, oddly, very advanced position. Let's see if we maybe get like an assist. Decent dribbling in the box. We'll look for a cut back. It maybe could have been a little bit better. I was trying to go to hemp right there. But really good attacking positioning. Sterling, nice. Oddly. Ooh, nice little drop of the shoulder right there. Fake shot as well. Four-star weak foot. It's a decent attempt. I think when it comes to creating chances, he's going to be very good. Track back a little bit. Oddly on defensive duty i can't lie man he's actually quite strong on on and off the ball this is very nice to see played it short nice oddly i will say man for the most part with the hunter chem style he is very quick especially when it comes to technical dribbling now we did win the penalty right there so we're gonna go ahead and give it to him 83 pens that's okay we'll go top left hey man we'll take it man what's the penalty converse the penalty nice start to the game oddly defensively hasn't been half bad either man that's a good tackle right there the manual defending feels all right nice little touch right there we'll go for a power shot oddly i'm not gonna lie boys out of all the evolutions i do think that he's probably your best option that's a fantastic strike maybe test out the dribbling some more r1 dribbling he is very quick man the hunter is a great chem style for the card left stick dribbling not half bad oh boys look at oddly go 
Decent dribbling right there, boys. I will say, doesn't have the craziest of agility and balance, but the left stick dribbling is still really good. The attacking position has been good so far as well. Play through. Oddly, little touch. My opponent doesn't really expect that. Power shot. Good finish, man. He can convert a lot of chances, man. He's very clinical. Good header right there. A little bit of space. Oddly, a lot of power behind his runs, man. With the hunter, he is very quick. Good pass into Hemp. We'll look for the cutback. It's a nice team play, man. We'll definitely take that. Slow down a little bit. Oddly, furthest man forward. A little step over. He's very quick, boys. I think the Hunter Kemp style works so well with the card. He's very clinical as well when he gets into really good areas. He can definitely bag you a lot of goals, get you a lot of assists as well. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into game number two. And so far, so good. We're coming up against Van Dijk, Pina Hernandez. He is evolving Athena, who is a fantastic card. Has Team of the Year Hansen as well. But yeah, man. So far, so good. I know a lot of people have been saying like that the midfield ev evolution is a bit mid. And I will say they probably could have used a bit better players. But overall, Adli has been fantastic so far. Adli, good left stick dribbling. I don't think he's going to track the run, so we'll go over the top. Boys, that is phenomenal. That's probably one of the best passes I've ever seen. Brilliant. Honestly, well, I'm low-key kind of speechless right there because the flight in the curve of the ball was fantastic. Oddly, we'll track back right here. A little bit of defensive cover. Good tackle. The one thing that I really like about the card, even though he doesn't have crazy defending stats, you do still get like that defensive cover with that intercept playstyle plus. Track back, track back, track back. Good boys. Very physical, very strong right there. That's nice. Good tackle again. Guy does have a corner tactic. Oddly, can we intercept it? We can. Decent right there. We'll just run with him. Can we get away from Hansen? And from Kafu. Oh, you know what, boys? Right there, he just kind of body checked us a little bit. It was actually good sprint speed. We got away from Hansen. Kafu's already back. Take your space, take your space, take your space. He is a very good ball carrier. We're going to get a little bit of jam right there. Out wide. Whip it in. Oddly, good attacking positioning. We go for a header. It is a fantastic finish, man. That is a lovely play. Great run forward again. Played to Sterling. See, right there, man. The high medium work rates. He's already making that run forward. Oddly. The heel to heel is a pretty decent skill move to incorporate into your game because he does only have three star skills. Decent hold up play. He's just controlling VVD. Ball roll. Trivella. Oddly, should have been a lot better right there. That's my bad. Good tackle, boys. I feel like if we, if we continue pressing like this, we should be good. Oddly, good attacking positioning. Good header as well. He's going to get himself an assist, man. He picks up really good pockets of space. Oddly. Left stick dribbling. We're going to take a touch right here. He's not going to expect it. Good power, man. Great power behind his runs. Very clinical as well. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into our final game using Oddly. And we're coming up against another really solid team. He is evolving. Brian Boniface, Pina, Salah, De Jong, Seedorf. And yeah, man. I must say, out of all the midfield evolutions that you can go ahead and complete, I do think that Oddly is probably your best option. There are some pretty decent players in there. Fring Pong will play it inside. Oddly, drop of the shoulder. That's nice. Touch. Can we get there? Ooh, boys. The pace right there was great, man. Decent cutback as well. Barcola. Take your space. I like the positioning of Adli right there. Look at him. Almost playing like a striker at the moment near post. Boys, he's one of the most clinical midfielders I've used all year in FC24, man. With the Hunter Kem style, it's fantastic. Adli carried the ball forward. Incorporate the pace again. He's very quick, man. He can get away from a lot of players. Over top. You know what? That was actually a really good ball for Adli, but it locked on to Barkola for some reason. Good pressure. Ooh, Hemp's made a really good run. Another great pass. His passing has been very consistent for the most part. It's a lovely team goal, man. I love it. Good tackle, good tackle. He tried to dribble right there with Ashley Cole. So he is a man down in the defense. Oddly, a bit further out. It's a decent attempt, boys, I will say. Oddly, all the way. Touch. Ah, he's ready with Van Dyke, but we keep the pressure up, which is nice. Ball roll, Trivella. Good shape to it. It's off of the crossbar, boys. Unlucky. Over top. He hasn't tracked the run. Good attacking positioning. The touch. Oh, it's off of the post, boys. That's so unlucky, man. Beautiful attacking positioning. A decent attempt on goal as well. Adli. Barkla with a really good run. It's a decent pass. Maybe needed a little bit more power. 
But it looks like we are going to find the back of the net, man. Another great team play. Adli's initial pass was pretty good. Maybe he just had to put a little bit more power. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Future Stars Evolution Adli in a few games of Foot Champions. And to be completely honest, man, a very solid player. Now, as you guys know, in order to complete the evolution, it is 25 games of Squad Battles, Division Rivals, or Foot Champions. It is a bit of a grind before it. You are getting a really good player. If we go ahead and dissect his in-game stats in a bit more detail, boys, I just want to go ahead and start off by saying that he can do everything really well in-game. Now the 89 pace with the Hunter Chem style, he does have 98 acceleration and 97 sprint speed. And with the way that he's built, man, he's really quick in game, especially when you want to like take a touch in front of him. 85 shooting for the most part was a phenomenal stat as well. 92 attacking positioning, 85 finishing. He was very clinical. And another huge part to his game is definitely his shot power and then also his long shots. His long shots are very consistent in game. Power shots, Trivellas, finesse shots. 89 passing a huge part to his game, his 90 short pass and 89 long pass. His passing for the most part was very accurate. Now, although the card does only have 89 dribbling boys he was quite quick and swift on the ball i do think that the lower agility and balance you know you kind of make up for it with his really high reactions his really high ball control and composure and i will say he isn't the most quick and swift player that i've ever used in fc24 but you can definitely get the job done with him now as a center mid we do need a little bit of defensive cover as well the 81 defending for the most part was pretty decent he does have the intercept play style plus which is very very effective in game and he does also have a bigger build with his physicality so in the middle defensively he was actually quite solid and then last but not least boys 82 physical a huge part to his game the 85 stamina could be a little bit better and then although he does only have 81 strength and 79 aggression he was quite strong on and off the ball which was great to see overall boys i'm gonna go ahead and give the card a 9 out of 10 rating i really enjoyed using him as a more advanced center mid like i said boys he can do everything really well going forward he's fantastic while still having that defensive cover which is huge for a center mid and yeah man if you do have the time to go ahead and grind 25 games i do think that he's probably your best option out of all 10 players ugarte is also a very solid option and we are going to go ahead and do a player review on him as well but oddly it definitely top three but that is going to be the end of today's video boys if you guys did enjoy it let me know by leaving a like comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another player review and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video i've been your boy bullbound i'll catch you guys in another one very very soon peace